the fourth industrial revolution made possible by ICT convergence. Robot, the paragon of the transformation. If so, how are robots made? Let's learn about robots. Lesson one, history. Rabota, a Czech word to describe labor by a Czech writer, Karel Čapek. In 1920, Čapek depicted a human form machine that subjected to forced labor under man's order in his play titled as R.U.R. Rasum's Universal Robots. However, the robot in the play was not the commonly known one, but rather a humanoid. The word robot is obtained after deleting the A. It signifies a machine resembling man with the ability to work on its own. The study of robots, the term robotics, was first coined by SF writer Isaac Asimov in 1941. It was after World War II when robotics technology emerged, thanks to the creation of computers and semiconductor devices. After the development of computers in 1954, an American inventor called George Devol came up with the ways to control machine operations and computer programs. It sent instructions to robots about the orders and methods to perform tasks via computer. In 1961, George Devol and Joseph F. Engelberger established the first robot company, Unimation. That same year, the first industrial robot, Unimate, was introduced to the public. It was in charge of carrying parts at GM's New Jersey plant. Since then, the demand for industrial robots have abruptly skyrocketed. In 1969, the first six-axis robot arm called Stanford Arm was invented in Victor Scheinman's lab in Stanford University. The first computer-controlled industrial robot, T3, was developed by Millicron in Cincinnati in 1974. To recap, the first industrial robot, Unimate, was invented in 1961. Followed by the Stanford Arm, the first six-axis robot arm. And T3, or the first computer-controlled industrial robot, in 1974. Ever since, the robot industry has made continuous development. The 1980s witnessed the burgeoning of the Korean robotics industry. The industry and academia started conducting robot R&Ds. In 1984, Hyundai Heavy Industries made a task force for robots in its welding R&D center. HHI developed its own unique model, HR120, for the first time in Korea in 1995. The achievement underscores the technological independence in a short period of time and laid a great foundation for the growth of the Korean robotics industry. During the 1990s, the support from the government helped the industry to thrive. It is because as automobile and semiconductor industries grew, the demand for automation grew higher. It established the groundwork for manufacturing robots in Korea. To this day, the development of intelligent robots made cobots, robots that work with people, smart factory marked by unmanned processes, and others. The epitome of future industry, robot. Despite its short history, there lies a promising future. Next, we shall move on to the structure of robots. Thank you.